I thought the Dutch use is actually pretty funny because I just did a whole five minute talk only to find out I didn't record. Uh, but instead of letting it uh, bring me down, I'll just have to say, listen, the second version will be better than the first version, right? That's taking a negative and making it in a positive. And that's actually the, the, the theme of the talk today that, you know, after spending about 12, 13 months since March of last year in my basement on the phone, uh, you know, 12, 13, 14 hours a day, five, six, seven days a week talking about the pandemic, you know, it's starting to have a negative impact on me or who I am as a person. I'm a people leader. I love to be out and about where the action takes place, or managing my walking around and, and socializing with people. And when you don't have that, you start missing that, that negative brain that you have. And we all have that. And actually, it's sadly to say the negative brain is the dominant part of the brain in most people. But if you become aware and mindfully present and understand the powers of the negative brain, you can actually do something about it. Right. So over time, I, you know, the, there was a great book written, The Positive Quotation, The Positive Intelligence. You check it out on Amazon. There's a really good read, but there's some very simple actions and understandings we all need to have as people. One, no different than empathy or emotional intelligence. If you want to live on a positive brain, it requires daily work. Right. So there's an exercise you need to do, and I would highly recommend, even before you get out of bed, Lay there for just five minutes instead of rushing out and facing the world. Just lay there and be mindfully present and think about things that make you happy. Or look at a smiling picture and see how that what kind of impact that has on your life. Four or five minutes every day. And then as you get the day going, lead with a smile. That's what my podcast was about earlier today. Every time you smile, every time you make somebody else smile, you feel better. Why? This is a little bit of dopamine is released into your brain, and that's our feel-good medicine. So take it from me that, you know, in order to maintain a strong, positive mind, it requires work on a daily basis. Be in tune with yourself when you feel like you're being pulled into the other side, because the negative side has a tendency to want to be dominant. Push back. Realize, take a deep breath, take some additional action steps on a daily basis to pull yourself out of that and maintain yourself in a positive brain. Have a wonderful day. Stay upbeat. Keep smiling. Keep sharing. And, and tell us about your experiences by making comments. And I look forward to seeing you uh, both on the DutchMentor.com. And I now have opened up the membership pages. So there'll be all kinds of content and discussion board uh, between uh, the, the members. Thank you. I will talk soon. Take care, everybody.